Hey, what is going on, everybody? It's Josh Wright back again with another video, and we have our first ever video on MLB The Show 24. We are doing a Road to the Show series. This is going to be a starting pitcher. He goes by the name of Joey Gibbs. Joey Gibbs, for those of you who don't know, uh, he is a, a starting pitcher out of out of Missouri. Decided to. I was uh, in the middle of deciding what I wanted to do for uh, for a YouTube series, either do Road to the Show or do you, or do uh, a franchise series. I think I'm going to settle on Road to the Show for right now. Uh, I just did the the combine, or we're in the middle of the combine right now, and uh, I think we're getting ready to play the first game. I will say the Road to the Show's stuff in here is actually really interesting. Like, the way they did Road to the Show this year is actually, I'm actually pretty impressed. Like, I love that they brought the uh, MLB Combine back. Which, for those of you who don't know, that was in the old Road to the Show, MLB the Shows from, like, MLB 14 up until, I believe, MLB 20. So, as you can see, there's Joey Gibbs making his first start in the MLB Combine Series here in Chase Field in Arizona. I, I really like this, to be completely honest with you. I thought I was not really going to enjoy MLB 24, uh, then again, you know, my opinions will change since this is my first time playing the game. Uh, so far, I'm not a huge fan of the graphics. Like, when I was customizing my player, oh my goodness, it looks, it looks terrible. It, it kind of looks, it looks a little bit more cheap. Kind of reminds me of the MLB 15, 16 days. And... Yeah, it's just, it's not the best, but we're going to roll with it because, well, we, we can. So you can see one, two count, Chase Shelley. He has been really keeping this at bat going. I get him looking on a slider for out number two. Now we move on. Here is James Jack. He looks like somebody who will probably be a first-round pick. There's a ground ball, probably to my shortstop, and that is out number three. Lots of people here at Arizona, as you can see. Uh, it's probably mainly just a bunch of scouts and everything. So, yeah, I, I am very interested to see how this road to, how Road to the Show does this year. Obviously, there were a lot of changes to the, to the game mode. This year is now, for the first time ever, you're allowed to pl to customize a girl player. And maybe later on, if this Joey Gibbs uh, Road to the Show series gets a little boring, maybe we could we could probably do a girls uh, a girl character down the road. I actually have a couple ideas for a girls character. I have a um, and if you guys are interested, uh, let me know. But for now, we're going to stick with Joey Gibbs, starting pitcher, future starting pitcher in the big leagues someday. He'll probably turn out to be like, uh, I, I don't know, maybe he'll be uh, either Roger Clemens without the steroids, or he'll turn out like uh, Patrick Corbin. <laughs> I don't know why I'm comparing my guy to Patrick Corbin. But who knows what goes on. Uh, I was kind of sad while uh, going through the the uh, pitching stances and everything. Whoa, that almost hit him. Look out. Base hit up the middle for Diego Velazquez. As I was saying earlier, when I was going through the uh, pitching windups and everything... I was kind of sad to see that Adam Wainwright wasn't in here anymore. Uh, Adam Wainwright, for those of you who don't know, is my my favorite player of all time. And uh, I've always used his pitching warm-up, his uh, wind-up and everything, just because I, I, I like it. I'm, I'm used to it. 
uh, being a Cardinals fan and everything. But since he's retired, I can't use that stance anymore and for that wind up anymore. And for some reason, it's not in the game. So that made me a little sad. So instead of Adam Wainwright, I had to go with the next best thing. And I decided to rock and roll with Pedro Martinez's uh, pitching uh, wind up and everything. There's a fly ball to right field. Catcher's made. If you guys hear noise in the back, it's my dog's probably barking. It's uh, it's currently storming outside. And so nothing else to do tonight rather than just stay inside, watch the thunderstorm, and play some MLB The Shell. So Matt Romero coming in. Bottom of the third, two outs. I believe my team is up one to nothing. There is a strike count is 0-2 to Mr. Matt Romero. Two outs already here in the f bottom of the third. There's a fly ball to right. Catch is made. And that's the inning. And they're going to let me get keep on uh, chugging along here in the fourth inning. Not too sure if we have anybody else, uh, any other pitchers that are going to come into the game. They'll probably come in after the fourth inning. I imagine this will probably be my last inning. Unless if uh, my coach decides, you know what, we're going to keep this guy in. So there was a, a feature in the game that I thought was pretty cool. And it showed like the projected... Uh, like where you're going to get drafted and everything. And I think I'm at like not I think I'm like the seventeenth overall pick or whatever. And it also shows you like the different teams and everything uh that's interested in you. Uh I had a few different teams that were pretty interested. Seems like uh, I will have to show you guys after this game. When I uh, when I get the chance, so two pitch fouled off again. So yeah, 69 mile per hour. Oh, 95 mile per hour fastball. Excuse me. For some reason, it said 69. There's a changeup. Get some looking. Out number three in the fourth. And guess what? We're gonna keep pitching in the fifth inning because that's that's what we do. Here in the. Uh, showcase games or the MLB Combine games that, which is what it's called now now I have to admit these jerseys that are actually pretty cool too I think I like the, the light blue jerseys in this game are pretty nice I, I think I would if they were real jerseys I would probably buy one I like the way they pop with the with the USA with the helmets and everything. I think it pops off really nice. Diego Velasquez got a base hit off of me earlier. Looks like he's going to do the same here again. And just like that, we're going to have a one-out single here in the fifth. That's going to bring in Cesar Jimenez. Let's see if we can try and get this guy to hit into a double play. If not, then we're going to go for a strikeout because that's strikeouts are pretty helpful in this game, as you guys know. And a ground ball to the shortstop. What did I tell you? Double play ball comes in here in the fifth. And we're going to keep going here in the sixth inning. Uh, that Diego Velazquez guy, he seems like he's got my number written down here in this game is I believe he's the only one who's gotten a base hit off of me in this game. But yeah, I'm very excited to see where we get drafted and everything, find out what team we'll probably land on as I pick up my sixth strikeout of the day 
for Mr. Joey Gibbs. Here's Humberto Savala. What a name. He, pro he sounds like a catcher. He probably is a catcher. For all we know, he pro. Oh, anyway. Ooh, fouled off again. Got a bunch of scouts in in the in attendance in this game. Fly ball to right, catches made out number two. And that's going to bring in Matt Romero. He's 0 for two, like most of this lineup that we have faced so far. Not too sure how many games we're going to be having uh, before the draft starts. I'm uh, I'm pretty interested in seeing where we get drafted, who drafts me, and kind of start my uh, minor league career. Fly ball to center field, catch is made, and we're going to get taken out going into the seventh. We win the game two to one. Overall, very solid performance there. And okay, so six innings, six strikeouts. And as you can see, there are the teams that are interested, just like what I talked to you guys about. So it says that I could probably be like a ninth projected round, thirteenth. Uh, so I could either go to the the Angels seem to be interested. You got the Rockies. Hopefully, I don't get end up with the Rockies. You got the Nationals. You got the Pirates. You got the Reds, the White Sox, Tigers, Guardians, and Boston Red Sox. So, a lot of teams seem to be interested. Uh, I would I wouldn't mind going to the Pirates or Pirates or Pittsburgh, Cincinnati, or Washington. I I would have no problem going to any of those. Uh, uh, those teams. All right, so now we move on. Game one's done. And it looks like we're going to simulate the rest of the games. And we got a perk, which is great. And we're getting a call. Uh-oh, what, uh, what's this? Stephanie Saunders is an agent. Hello, Joey. How is my favorite client? What should we say? Hi, Stephanie. A bit disappointed after my combine performance. Hi, Stephanie. What's up? Uh, why? I don't know if I'd be disappointed. Hi, Stephanie. What's up? Man, these graphics look absolutely terrifying. Well, I don't think you're perform you performed quite up to your potential at the combine, but you still had a good showing. I'm hearing that we should expect you to be drafted somewhere between round 16 and 14. Stephanie, I was expecting to be drafted much earlier. That seems a little bit low. All right, let's see what happens. Uh, uh, yeah, I would honestly prefer to be drafted a little higher. Uh, let's just see what happens. Yeah, your hard work is paying off. That team that drafts you will be very lucky to have you. No doubt I'm going to be, I'm going to be a star. I believe in myself regardless where I get drafted. Still a lot of work to be done. We're just getting started. Exactly. I believe in you. I know you're going to be, be going to do big things. By the way, we can't really determine which team will draft you, but I'm curious, do you have a team preference? There is one team I'd really love to play for. I want to play for the team that wants me the most. Yep, that's that's probably what we're going to do. Well, I can't guarantee anything, but I have a feeling you're going to end up in, in a great spot. We'll ju but we'll just have to wait and see what happens. Thanks, Stephanie. What happened? There we go. Man, oh man, that Ste Stephanie Saunders, that picture does not look... <laughs> it looks scary. I'm sorry. It just looks scary. All right, what's going on? We're at the MLB draft. Sixteenth pick. Oh no, we're going to the Rockies. 
No, not the Rockies. I just said I don't want to go to the Rockies. And I got drafted by the Rockies. <laughs> oh, man. What should we do? Uh, am I excited? I'm relieved, disappointed. I've, I'm kind of disappointed. <laughs> not going to lie. I really... But he's going to be excited. Look at him. He's fake. He's faking his excitement. That he got drafted by the Colorado Rockies. Ah oh, man, we're this is not going to be fun. Oh man, the Rockies ended up drafting us. I felt like I had a pretty solid MLB combine. Yeah, I agree with Sarah completely, Robert. Uh, there are some question marks, but I do see upside. What I also see is a really good floor for this individual player. And, you know, guys with good floors sometimes end up being some of the better players that come out of the draft. Well, you know what? I think we are. I think Joey Gibbs is going to be a great. Hey, Joey, congrats on, on getting drafted by the Rockies. I couldn't be happier for you. Thanks. How do you feel about being the newest member of the Rockies franchise? I'm not thrilled. Yeah, I am not thrilled. I literally just said I don't want to play for the Rockies. I I got drafted by the Rockies. So, uh, might as well just fake it to be like, yeah, I'm happy to be here. It's lucky that they're lucky to have you. How are you feeling about the draft position? Feel like I should have been drafted earlier. Yeah, I I really think I should have. Yeah, you definitely went later when I than I was hoping. I'm surprised you since you had a solid performance at the combine. I know, and now everyone's like, oh no, this guy didn't have a good performance. Of course, I had a good performance. Six strikeouts and in six innings. Is that terrible? Yeah, I'm just ready to get to work. Yep, but it's okay that. Hey, though, now is your chance to prove your true value at the professional level. Exactly, I'm going to make... Yeah, I'm going to get... I'm just ready to get to work. Exactly, I'm going to make every organization that passed on me <laughs> regret their decision. I'm looking forward to showing me what I can do. <sighs> the Rockies. The Rockies. I got, We got drafted by the Rockies. No offense. I'm sorry, Rockies fans, if there's any watching this video. But we're going to have to make it work. Uh, I've talked to the Rockies, and they've told me they're, they will be starting at, you'll be starting at the AA level with the Hartford Yard Goats. Keep doing what you do, do to stay at the top of your game mentally and physically. Then, and you'll be good to go when you get when you report to Hartford in April. Thanks, Stephanie. I appreciate you. Ha oh, man, what a, an eventful first episode, ladies and gentlemen. And before we sign off, we're gonna meet with the Hartford Yard Goods manager, Manuel Quintana. Joey Gibbs, let me officially welcome you to the Yard Goats. That's probably one of the cool things about working playing for the Rockies is that I get to play for the Yard Goats. You're ready to put some serious work in? Heck yeah, coach. Which I'm, I'm really looking forward to it. Good. Glad to hear it. In the minors, you, you get what you put in. Work hard. Don't give me any problems and you'll be fine. And don't forget to work with your teammates. Help them be their best and they'll do the same for you. You got it, Skip. Sure, I plan to to be a team player. You don't have to worry about me. I don't plan on being down here in Double A very long. Um, you got it, Skip. Looks like somebody tried to send me a message there on the PlayStation thing. Okay, great meeting you. We're glad to to have you here. Hope you're ready to get to work. That's it for now. Good luck out there, Joey. 
And ladies and gentlemen, that's probably going to do for the first episode of this Road to the Show series. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you guys did, you guys know what to do. Leave a like, subscribe, comment down below. Are you guys excited about this Road to the Show series? Do you think... Uh, what's your thoughts on this? Do you think we're going to turn the Rockies around? Let me know what you guys' thoughts and opinions are. And with that said, I'm going to end this video now. Oh, and uh, yeah. That's going to do it for today. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll talk to you guys.